Look at the size of the lamb chop. It's so beautiful. And uh, outside, it's a layer of the spice and the marinated very well and the grilled very well. And there is uh, some fat outside. Mm. Hello everyone, I hope everyone having very good day. Jahan Traveler is here. Today we are in the Chetham Hill, Manchester. And we are here to test uh, some authentic and delicious uh, Turkish food. They call Sultan, just uh, behind me, Sultan Turkish Grill. They are well known for the Turkish food. And uh, let's go in and eat uh, some delicious Turkish food. Well, we are in the Sultan Turkish Grill restaurant and absolutely the menu is so beautiful and there is a lot of authentic uh, Turkish kebabs in here and we are going to try some delicious and juicy Turkish kebab. kitchen and I was watching chef uh, when he's grilling uh, kebabs absolutely so friendly chef and when they grilling with charcoal I love it because the charcoal give a nice smoky flavor and I cannot wait to test uh, some delicious Turkish uh, kebabs and uh, right now we got uh, some Turkish hummus look at this one is a top is a sumach and a nice hummus cucumber and the olives and then here we have a nice uh, turkish bread mm. this is the savory and a little bit crunchy of the cucumber. Absolutely beautiful starter. And the bread is so soft and so fresh. Look at this one. It's a bit spongy. And just you need uh, some hummus. Just mix it. Mmm, I love hummus. They are a little bit savory and a little bit salty, but they are amazing. Wow, beautiful, thank you. some delicious kebab absolutely they know how to cook a kebab and uh, we have got it here mixed grill is a uh, ribs lamb ribs and uh, kufte look at this one lamb kufte is so nice and chicken beans and we have a marinated lamb cube and then we have again marinated 
chicken cube absolutely it smells so delicious so nice with the grilled the vegetable chili and the tomato and in here we have a lamb chop look at the size of the lamb chop it's so huge and the cooked very nice and it's come with the rice with Turkish rice absolutely amazing and in here we have a, one of the, my favorite kebab they call yogurt kebab and uh, it's the top is uh, some donor kebab and down here is a donor kebab and then yogurt and bottom side is a, a fresh uh, Turkish bread and the side we have a rice and some fresh salad look at this lamb ribs it's cooked so nice look at this one a little bit fatty full of juice and outside a little bit crispy I love it mm. it's cooked very nice a little bit fatty but full of juice and so tender amazing I really love it outside is a full of a spice with a layer of the spice Turkish spice mm. I love the grill lamb grill or chicken grill absolutely it's one of the, my favorite and uh, here we have a chicken wings look at this one it's outside is a layer of the spice and the cooked with charcoal Mmm, very soft, full of flavor. Just a bone come up so easily. And in here we have a kufta. Look at this one. The kufta cooked so nice. Inside the kufta there is a parsley and some tomato, some uh, peppers. And look at this one. Inside is good and cooked very nice. Mmm, amazing, so delicious, full of flavor. Outside is a little bit crispy, and I love it. Turkish lamb kufte was full of flavor, and now we have a chicken kufte. Look at this one. Outside is a little bit crispy, and again, inside is the parsley. Um, chop it, the green peppers and red peppers. Mm, very soft and a little bit crunchy. I love it because they grill it with charcoal. When they grill with charcoal and all the kebabs get a nice flavor. It's amazing to cook with charcoal. Grill it, green chili. Mmm, crunchy, hot, spicy, and we have a look at this one. Chicken cube. It's a chicken breast, marinated and cooked very well. Mmm, very soft, full of flavor and marinated very well and uh, grill it very well and we have a lamb cube again look at this one it's uh, marinated very well and uh, so tender mm. there is a lot of spice outside the Islam I love this mixed grill combination was beautiful we have a lamb and we have a chicken and we have a lamb ribs and the lamb cube and chicken cube was amazing and presentation was absolutely so beautiful with the grilled vegetable 
and we have our uh, chips as well. Look at this one. Just the bottom side, we have a chips. Mm. And now we're going to test the lamb chop. Look at the size of the lamb chop. It's so beautiful and uh, outside it's a layer of the spice and the marinated very well and the grilled very well and there is uh, some fat outside mm. so tender amazing I love lamb chop it's so tender and it's full of flavor absolutely they cooked so nice mm, the fat is so delicious look at this fat it's a little bit fatty but fat is full of flavor so easy to eat at this lamb shop and we have a rice as well here look at this turkish rice very soft and a little bit oily but absolutely melting in my mouth so delicious and uh, in here we have a yogurt kebab yogurt kebab and there is a few kind of the yogurt kebab we have a lamb yogurt kebab, we have a chicken yogurt kebab. In here, they call the donor yogurt kebab. Donor kebab, and then yogurt, and the bottom side, there is a, a bread. Donor, and yogurt. Mm, bread is uh, so soft and the juice of the donor kebab is full of flavor and donor kebab is a little bit crunchy but amazing look at this one mm. donor kebab is a little bit crunchy and the bread is so soft and full of flavor and the beautiful combination look at this one yogurt and uh, some donor kebab it's uh, so beautiful mm. super delicious i love the crunchiness of the donor kebab yogurt is a little bit savory but the bread is full of flavor and there is a lot of juice inside of this uh, bread look at this juice they use is a tomato sauce absolutely full of flavor look at this one mm, so delicious And now we use uh, some yogurt with this uh, rice. Beautiful combination. I love it. This rice is a little bit fluffy but is melting in my mouth amazing they cooked very nice we have a side salad with chili
so refreshing. And after heavy meal, and we need uh, just a Turkish tea and the baklava. Baklava is one of the dessert I love it. Look at this one. It's a pistachio and uh, bread with nice uh, syrup. Mmm, yummy very sweet so delicious at the bottom side is a just a syrup a sugar syrup and the middle is a pistachio amazing mm. and Turkish tea when you have a baklava with tea you don't need any sugar cube or sugar Wow, I love it. And in here we have a fresh made uh, canafe. Look at this one. Syrup and the cheese and the layer of the cheese. Look at the canafe. Mm. Very crunchy and sweet and we have an ice cream with canafe Look at this one, it's stretchy mm. Very sweet and so crunchy, so delicious It's a very sweet canafe. It's so sweet and a little bit crunchy. But if I want a choice for dessert, I like more baklava. Baklava has a sweetness, but the sweetness is not super sweet. And it has a crunch, it has a sweetness, and amazing. This dessert, I love it. It's beautiful. And Turkish food, I really love it. And the mixed grill, and the lamb chop, and the yogurt kebab, all of them was full of flavor and so delicious. And it was absolutely very nice atmosphere to come down in Chitom Hill and test some authentic Turkish food. If I want to pick my favorite food in here, I will go with the lamb chop. Lamb chop was cooked very nice, full of flavor and so tender. And now I am coming to end today's video. I hope you like it my video. If you like it, just give me a thumbs up and leave me comments below. Or if you haven't subscribed yet, just subscribe. Then if you want to see our next video, just press the bell icon. If you press the bell icon, definitely you will notify our next video. I hope see you all in next video.